painter and sculptor Georg Baselitz is one of Germany's leading contemporary artists. Many of the world's most important museums display his artworks. How would you describe your personality? If I do something bad or make a bad impression, then I tend to blame my personality. I apply the same principle to others. If they make a bad impression, it's because of their personality. To me, character is always formative and often negative. Who is your personal hero? That's a difficult question. I have family role models. The brother of my father, it couldn't be my father because that would be all wrong. So my uncle, who was a pastor, he was very important during my adolescence, before I became a student. Later I tried to get to know leading artists, but most of them were dead or only just alive. The first who made a big impression on me, but was already dead, was Edward Munch. But strangely, I still see him as something of a role model, even to this day. What's an irresistible temptation? Wanting to own other people's paintings. Do you have a personal philosophy? That's a tough one. Until I'd fully developed, biologically speaking, I was a very rebellious and aggressive person. It might have been wiser to repress that or ignore it. My current state of biological tranquility is much more agreeable. Do you have an unfulfilled dream? I'm a collector, and what I still really need is a Becca Fumi, if that means anything to you. A chiaroscuro woodcut by Becca Fumi. It might seem ridiculous, but that matters a lot to me. What drives you bananas? Politics. What's your idea of a perfect day? Concentrating on work for two or three hours, not just having the time, but really working.